Welcome back to Roy Family Farm. I'm Chris and we've got some stuff we gotta get done today. I've been working on some fencing here and uh, it's kind of taken longer than uh, I expected it to. A lot of other stuff came up which is just part of having a farm. So the uh, cows and the horse are in a pasture that they've been for a while, haven't been rotated. So the grass is eating down pretty good, so we've been feeding out hay pretty much this whole time, so. So we, uh, we're kind of in crunch time to get them moved here. But, I just fed out the last bale of hay, so. On the agenda for the morning is to go get some hay. And then we will be plucking away at the uh, fencing, but this is just part of it, I guess. Never ends on the farm. Like I was saying, we uh, gotta hurry up, get this hay. It's been raining, so we got a break in the rain, so we're gonna get that done now. Um, hopefully I could get the majority of the fencing stuff done. I got a post and a cross brace to put in and some tension wire. Uh, hopefully I can at least stretch some fence and uh, open in the gate here. Well, maybe. There we go. But hopefully I could get some uh, fence stretched here. I don't know. We'll see. It's really weather dependent, so. All right, got the hay paid for, got it loaded. You can probably see it back there in the bed of the truck. Just 20 bales. We don't need a whole lot. We're just trying to get through to uh, getting this fencing done. And we only have three Dexters and uh, a horse that we're feeding out hay. So should get the job done. Well, as you could probably tell, since I'm wearing different clothes, it is a, another day. Did not get nearly as far with that fencing as I wanted to. Uh, I pretty much, I got all the tension wire that I was doing done. Um, and I put in a post and cross brace and sort of got some woven wire in place. I, I got it rolled out on the ground and cut the length and started cutting the verticals. But uh, then it was dinner time, so I called it a day. So we're back at it. We'll get that stretch today and we might actually be able to get the whole pasture finished. So we'll see how it goes. Well, I didn't get as much done as I would like to. I just got this stretch of woven wire right here done and I hung this gate that we got right here. The uh, weather didn't quite cooperate with us, but we're slowly but surely getting it done. I just got a few few more gates to hang and uh, some cattle panels to put up and then it's just cleaning up this pasture. There's some old telephone poles right back there. Down over here, we got some old hay and there's some more sm short sections of telephone pole over there, but once we get all that done, it'll be moving time for the animals. 
Fencing day three. Yesterday we didn't really get too much accomplished, but we did get some progress on the fencing project we got going on. We got this gate in here that'll go from that pasture to this one that we're putting in. We got some cattle panels up across the barn here on both sides, so we just need to put a gate in the middle of there. All right, update on the pasture expansion. I actually feel like I made some progress today. I'm pretty stoked on it actually. Finally feeling like we're moving forward here. I got this gate right here in place. That was actually one of the last things I did. But yeah, got that in place. Come over here. Got this cattle panel in place here. This gate, you've seen already, I believe, that it was in place. But the barbed wire that's running behind it got clipped, wrapped around the post, stapled. So that's done now. We got this gate at the back of the barn in place. So, got that. We have the cattle panels across the back of the barn. I set two posts inside the barn, which right here, cemented that in because it's not really going to get any weather, so it shouldn't really rot. We'll put a cattle panel here. There'll be a four foot gate right in between the pole barn posts and that. We got another post cemented in right here, and we'll have an eight foot gate in between that and the next post. This area right here will be a shelter area for the animals to get out of the weather and we'll <clears throat> we may uh, put some hay in there but all we got left now is cleaning up this pasture basically and then that little bit inside the barn so I, I'm, I'm actually pretty happy with the progress today it turned out to be a beautiful day and I actually was able to get some work done so not a bad day at all